Here's a fact. We need cleaner cars if we want to slow down climate change. Cars and trucks produce almost a quarter of the greenhouse gas emissions in the U.S. Worldwide, they produce almost 17%. But the road to cleaner cars might be longer and dirtier than we think. Here's the situation. Back in the 90s, Europe pushed more efficient diesel cars with tax incentives. The problem is, while diesel engines produce less CO2 than petrol or gas-powered engines, they emit a number of harmful pollutants, including nitrogen dioxide, which creates smog and acid rain. Also back in the 90s, but on the other side of the Atlantic, the U.S. threw $1.5 billion at its struggling auto industry to develop a car that could drive 80 miles per gallon, but that never materialized. 20 years later, the average fuel economy of new vehicles sold in the U.S. is just over 25 miles per gallon, and companies like Tesla, Chevy, and Nissan have been betting on electric cars. Why are we making electric cars? Uh, why does it matter? Um, it's because it's very important to accelerate the transition to sustainable transport. Tesla boss Elon Musk says electric cars are cleaner than their gas-chugging counterparts and are the fastest way to reduce emissions from the transportation sector. But some question if electric cars are actually all that clean, pointing out they often charge their batteries using electricity that comes from coal-burning plants. That is changing as electric grids get greener, and increased power demand from electric cars could help drive investments in clean energy. But transforming the world's power grids will take decades. Now here's the argument. Critics say initiatives like Europe's diesel push and the US supercar show the danger of governments trying to pick winning technologies. But advocates of alternative fuel cars point to California, where a mix of tightening emission standards for manufacturers and rebates for consumers encourage investment in a range of newer technologies. The real wildcard is China and India. Sales of electric vehicles are growing rapidly in China, but not so in India. And the huge demand for new cars in both countries could quickly cancel any real progress in the quest for cleaner cars.